listening to to PBN. Your path back to stability here. Happy Mother's Day to all you incredible women out there. Wow. (laughs) The power of a mom, huh? Brought us all here. Nobody's sitting here listening to this. I'm not sitting here talking to this without mom. It's wild when you wrap your head around it. Think about it. The power of a woman. (sighs) Made every person ever. (laughs) Talk about inequality. Talk about inequality, the one creature in the universe that can make all the people. Oh, goodness. It's good to be alive, PBN family. It's good to be at the helm of the Prepper Broadcasting Network. To listen to that intro and to be with you this morning on a chilly, another chilly morning in Virginia. Many cold mornings this year. Very interesting. Don't get me into my, uh, the lizards are going to turn it into an ice age conspiracy all right at the moment (laughs) and i ain't joking but look i'm gonna give you two tips up front um for mother's day all right if you're if you're behind the eight ball or if you want to add to uh your your wife or your mother your grandmother's day whatever you want to do um we are running a special for our membership promo code mama bear one word mama bear Mama Bear gets you 10 bucks off the membership, the annual, okay? So it'll be 50 bucks for the year. If you got a, a would-be prepper mama in your life or a uh, somebody who you just want to expose to the full radiation of the Prepper Broadcasting Network, <laughs> promo code Mama Bear, okay? Um, and I'm going to tell you also about probably one of the coolest things you can do for Mother's Day right now if you forgot a gift if you you know need a nice affordable gift even cheaper than our membership Um, but very very meaningful I mean really hard to wrap your head around just how far this one goes and and right in line with the conversation we opened the show with Uh, I I heard about pre-born from the Glenn Beck program Never heard of them before, never knew what they did. Uh, I think you might be hearing from them more often here at PBN because I think we're going to donate some ad time to Preborn. What they do essentially, and, and what I love about this organization is, I don't know, they're, they're, what they offer is a game changer in the world of abortions. So what preborn does is they give mothers who are on the fence about having their children for whatever circumstance, circumstance irrelevant, they give mothers the chance to have a free uh, ultrasound to listen to their child, you know, and this has a tremendous effect on a mother who's considering abortion. The ability to hear their baby's heart and to understand, you know, maybe this ain't just a clump of cells of, as I've been told my whole life. Uh, maybe this is the ticket to meaning and, and the ticket to a good life, which I don't know any mother who has ever had a baby planned or unplanned that would argue that. <clears throat> what preborn does is give give women... The ability to hear the heartbeat of their child if they're considering abortion or if they're on the fence and not considering going through with the pregnancy. And it makes a huge difference. They saved almost 60,000 babies last year. Okay. Now, what's really cool about preborn? Well, they also provide mom with, with, uh, I think like two years of support financially. You know, not like paying all your bills, but some, some health care, that kind of stuff. I don't know the full details on that side of it. You can go to preborn.com. The cost of an ultrasound is only 28 bucks. So you donate 28 bucks and you pay for one of these ultrasounds so a woman can come in and say, "Hey, uh, you know, I I just want to hear 
my baby's heartbeat figure out what decision I'm going to make and listen there really is no as far as I'm concerned preborn and they also introduced the moms to the gospel and and the word you know which can have a profound effect obviously um but as far as I'm concerned there's no more strategic weapon against abortion than preborn really i mean there really isn't you know because it's not it it's it just fits right in there it fits right into everybody's needs and desires i don't know i think it's a beautiful thing again $28 donation and you can give the gift of a free ultrasound to someone who might be on the fence about having their child and and what that could wind up meaning is you save someone's life so go to preborn.com and uh check them out they do a lot of good work i'm probably going to talk to them in the very near future to see to well just to let them know you know we're going to we're going to create a commercial for preborn and have them on our network because i really believe in what they do you know you can get all sort of left wing right wing on it or pro life pro choice on it um but there is something to be said about outcomes there is something to be said about efficacy you know all this screaming and even all this praying outside of abortion clinics i don't know how much of an effect that has but if you can save 60,000 babies in one year you're doing something that works and that's who we need to support so preborn.com check them out mama bear promo code at pbnfamily.com to become a member all right two quick mother's day gifts um if you're behind the eight ball (laughs) online gifts can save the day man look what i got you i've been planning it for months um what else did i want to talk about today oh so the so the g5 storm um is going to carry on you know the 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 the, uh, the strongest waves of this thing have since passed i didn't get a chance to get out and see the aurora i fell asleep last night we all fell asleep last night and uh I don't. It was somewhat. Clear. It was raining when I fell asleep, so I don't know. Maybe we missed out on a golden opportunity. Maybe not. Yes, yeah, Sarah Hathaway. She'll tell you the sun's very busy. Probably won't be your last shot at a G five. <laughs> but who knows? Um, but for us preppers, you know, it's very interesting to go through a a CME of that size and scope. Well, a number of them, and see how everything weathers. You know, see how things go. I, uh, I'm blown away at the idea of what the sky must look like in a, in a, a hit from the sun that is earth shattering, almost literally speaking. Do you know what I mean? Like what, what, how crazy must it, must it look, excuse me, when, when the G5 is like a little, little baby. Compared to the storm that uh, could have hit us 14,000 years ago. Something like that. But for those of us who are, you know, EMP conscious, if you will. (laughs) It's really cool to see events like this happen. Get all the updates. See what's going on. I ask some people to keep, keep track of high frequency radio for me. And see if there are disruptions in that. I haven't heard anything. As far as radio being disrupted. Uh, probably one of the most important to me anyway, and I don't, I'm not an expert at measuring the effects of these solar storms, but one of the most important updates for me was to see what Elon Musk was saying about Starlink. If Starlink was disrupted, you know, cause the way I look at it is if, if something measurable like Starlink is up in a G5 solar storm, then we can look at these solar storms a little differently, right? If they, if they haven't disrupted the internet from the satellites at that that high in outer space or in near Earth orbit, then I feel like we can be pretty confident in what's going on. Pretty confident in in uh, the solar storm needs to be much larger to shut the power off to areas. Now, I did read that that Spectrum, I think it was, in Florida had some outages. I don't know if that had anything to do with the solar storm or not. Um, I have, I've heard terrible stories about that internet service provider, to be honest with you. Um, I never had them, so I can't say anything from personal experience. But all that said, yeah, here we sit. 
It's a sunny Sunday morning in Virginia. The grass is green. The pit bulls are anxious. The uh, <laughs> coffee is good. I'm waiting for mom to wake up now. It's been the first... Uh, this will be the first year in many years that I just get to go down the street and see my own mother. Uh, but but mom here is, you know, is the maker of dreams, so she'll sleep in and she's got a bunch waiting for her. It's going to be a good day. I wouldn't say that it's uh, um, time to give up your off-grid dreams and your off-grid preparations. I wouldn't say that it's time to give up on those EMP cloth plans, those SLNT purchases, those mission darkness purchases, those whatever, you know, that EMP shield you've always wanted. I wouldn't say look at this event as a uh, sort of a Trump 1 2016 throw prepping out the window event. I don't think many of you would. Because Thank God nothing happened on Mother's Day weekend and we didn't have massive power outages and things like that. But what is astounding about an event like this and what was really what we have to keep in mind is that this all unfolded over like three days. You know what I mean? Four days, something like that. That was the lead time. Like the earth explodes. <laughs> I'm sorry. The sun explodes and, and spits out massive amounts of energy and it's coming baby that's it you know when when it happens we don't know when it when these sunspots are going to give way to these massive explosions and when they do um that's it it's coming and if we're we're in the line if we're going to get hit by it then we're going to get hit by it and everything you've done up until then is is what you've done you know and i don't want to like be scary about it but it's just important to know tomorrow something ten times as strong could come burping out of one of these giant sunspots and then, you know, you got four days turnaround time. Now, to many of you, that shouldn't be scary. To many of you, you should be saying, okay, well, we've had a plan. We've been working towards this because talking about life off-grid is nothing new here at PBN, right? Talking about it moving towards a life of off-grid living is nothing new here at PBN. These are concepts we've talked about for a long time. So it's important that we, you know, wrap our head around that and say, full steam ahead, baby. What I would say, particularly for those of you who are new or those of you who have been sort of head down prepping for a long time, is, you know, try to fold in some things that you've always wanted, some things that you've always wanted to do, some things that make life better for you, you know? In other words, if preppers are telling you you need to grow amaranth, but you've always wanted to grow a big bunch of corn like your grandpa used to, you know what I mean? Do do what you want to do. You know, if, if they're telling you to learn how to shoot twenty two, to kill small game, but you've always wanted to shoot traditional archery, you know what I mean? Then learn how to shoot game with traditional archery and practice traditional archery in your backyard. And and by injecting a little bit of yourself and a little bit of your desires into prepping, that really how, is how you create this life that is wonderful, this life that is meaningful, this life that is fun, right? Isn't that what we're trying to do here? That's prepping sort of, uh, not to steal uh, Shelby Gallagher's phrase, but it, that really is prepping 2.0, isn't it? Once you get over the hump of, oh my god, I'm so unprepared, I don't know what to do, buy, 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 store, store, store. At the next point, you're sort of picking and choosing the class of survivor that you wish to be when it all comes down. And that's a hell of a lot of fun. As long as you feel free enough to go after the things that you want to be. Right? As long as you feel free enough and confident enough to go after the things that you want. And that's what prepping has always done for me, man. It's always done that for me. It's always been a doorway into places I never felt like I belonged. Right? It's always been that for me. And it's it's made me into something that I never even thought possible. Because of that. 
You know, the things that I do now on a weekly basis are a collection of things that I never thought I would do ever. You know, like no business being that type of guy. A lot of it's your guy's fault, in all honesty. A lot of it's your fault. You know, you could have shooed me away years ago. And who knows what kind of life I'd be living. I'd be scurrying right now, I guess. I'd be scurrying since 2020. What am I supposed to do? I'd be watching, like, the city prepper or something like that. I don't know what I would do. <laughs> It'd have been a different ride, though, I tell you that much. I'll tell you that much. If I never picked up the microphone on that uh, prepper podcast radio network gig... It would have been a very interesting life. No doubt about it. What I'd have missed out on. Wow. You talk about that, right? What you can miss out on in life. If you don't seize that day. What is the value of it? How much money is a Dave Jones worth? How much money is friendship with a Dave Jones worth? How much money is friendship with a Jay Ferg worth? You know what I mean? What is a Carl B worth? What is a Sarah Hathaway valued at? <laughs> Having one of those in your life. How do you go buy one? You know? What What about you guys? You know? What about the great listeners of PBN? I could pluck a number of you out of the hat too. And say, you know, where do you go find somebody like that to sow into your life? Where do you go buy one of them? Where do you go buy a volcano at? A garden girl? Yeah. A lot of things in our lives are priceless, PBN family, and we don't appreciate it. And uh, probably the biggest of them all is mom. Right? Probably the largest of them is mom. Because where would you be? Who knows where you'd be if not for mom? You certainly wouldn't be here. You certainly wouldn't be within the sound of my voice. You'd be out there in the ethereal realm. I guess your soul floating about. I don't know how it works, to be honest with you. Um, but I'm happy to be sitting here in front of the fire ring on a chilly morning talking to you. And I gotta make sure I thank my own mother for that. Today. All right? I hope you guys have a great morning. Happy Mother's Day to all the incredible women out there who have uh, done the thing that just, you know, makes this society go on. The most important thing of all. Oh, and my wife did tell me in jest, not in concern at all, because we don't concern ourselves with the fools. Um, but she did tell me in jest that there's a movement. To take Mother's Day and turn it into a special person's day. And Father's Day, by the way. Mother's Day and Father's Day. And, and change them into special person's day so as to be inclusive. And uh, this is where I want you to polish up your no. Right? This is where you polish up that no I was talking about on Wednesday. Polish that baby up. And be prepared to uh, share that with other people around you. If you, if you hear someone talking about Special Persons Day or if you <laughs> come face to face, unfortunately, with a lunatic who is not happy with your Mother's Day balloon or whatever, you, you just give them one of those nice strong no's. And if you want to if you want to tie the ribbon of an expletive or two on top of that, then I think that's fair as well. For my family, we spent the remainder of the evening... Uh, cracking jokes about special persons day and and you can go as far with that as you'd like but lady liberty brought that up to me on the way out to dinner last night and it was between me her and my two boys you know we can have a lot of fun with left-wing craziness <laughs> and we sure did all right happy mother's day pbn family have a great day man what if i told you you could own land for two hundred dollars down and highly affordable monthly payments. Yourcheapland.com is your answer to bug out land, hunting, recreation, and whatever else your uh, prepper mind can dream up. Yourcheapland.com has properties in Texas, New Mexico, Colorado, Oklahoma, Arizona, Utah. Go to yourcheapland.com, check out the properties, use the promo code PBN, and get $100 off your purchase.